Hi hey everyone, it's Eva Vigajono. Welcome back to more Pokemon Crystal. Last time we got here to Pewter City, and we're going to take on Brock this episode. Brock, the leader of Rock type Pokemon, as we all know. So anyway, let's head inside. And I know he has a trainee, and guess what? We can't skip him. So we're going to skip his actual battle anyway. Ha ha ha! All right, let's take on Brock. Wow, it's not often that we get a challenge from Johto. I'm Brock, the Pewter City Gym Leader. I'm an expert in rock type Pokemon. My Pokemon are impervious to most physical attacks. You'll have a hard time inflicting any damage. Come on! Alright, so this is Brock, the first gym leader in Kanto. And the ninth in the game. First up, he's going to be using his Graveler. It's going to be level 41. It's a rock ground type. And it has the moves Defense Curl, Rock Slide, Rollout, and Earthquake. It's not going to be hard to take down, considering I'm starting out with a Water-type Pokemon. And we all know that this thing has a crap special defense, and it is quad weak to Water and Grass. Really, if you have a Water or Grass-type in for this fight, then yeah, don't, you don't have a problem at all. One other thing, it's pretty obvious that you cannot affect Ground-types with Electro-type moves, but Electro-type Pokemon now have, his, now have their chance to shine, because he has a Kabutops. Kabutops level 42. With the move Slash, Surf, Endure, and Giga Drain. It is a rock water type. Yes, that is right. Electric type moves can affect rock type Pokemon. Even though a lot of people don't actually know that, which, which is actually pretty sad. Now, the one thing I'm kind of worried about here with Weezing is that he actually has Surf. But I'm pretty sure that he had to stand up to it, considering Kabutops has, Kabutops, sorry, has a horrible special attack. Like, I mean, it's dreadful. Yeah, that's not doing too much. Uh, poison, it's alright. Hmm. Alright, he's got no idea what's coming his way. Huh. Uh, good job, Brock. Yeah, that's right. You do stuff. I swear to God, if he gets a crit, I'm gonna scream. Yeah, that's right. You get hit by poison. You're about to go BOOM! Ha ha ha! Ha ha ha! Screw you, Kabutops. Alright. God, my Weezing's probably gonna hate me. Poor Weezing. Uh, Alright, you know what? We'll go back into Feraligator. I don't even know what he's gonna send out now. <laughs> Omastar! Okay, Omastar! Level 42 with the moves Bite, Surf, Protect, and Spike Cannon. It is a Rock Water type again. And this is the special attacker. It has a high defense yet again, like Kabutops. Oh no, you're using Spike Cannon, which did a whole 4 HP damage. And then it did another whole 4 HP again. Oh wow, you hit three times and took 12 damage away. Whatever will I do? KILL YOU! Spike Cannon is the worst move. I don't even know why you would teach it to Omastar. Seriously. Alright, next up, he's going to be using... Onyx. Onyx! Rock Ground type with Bind, Rock Slide, Bite, and Sandstorm. Ah, jeez. You know, it's funny because he has a level 44 Onyx, he's the ninth gym leader in the game, and yet he can't even pull a Steelix out of his backside. I mean, even the sixth gym leader in the game has a Steelix. Ah, Kanto disappoints me. In this generation, at least. Last time he's going to be using his Rhyhorn. Rhyhorn. Ground Rock type. It has the moves Fury Attack, Scary Face, Earthquake, and Horn Drill. Yes, that is right. It has a one hit KO move, so you're gonna watch out for that. Um level 41, I'm pretty sure it's one level off of evolving actually. That is so sad. Come on guys. Ah, jeez. Alright, Brock's being defeated! Your Pokemon's powerful attack so overcame my rock hard defense! You're stronger than I expected. Go ahead, take this badge. And we get the Boulder Badge from Brock. Seven more badges to go in this game. EBJ, thanks. I enjoyed battling you, even though I am a bit upset. That Boulder Badge will make your Pokemon even more powerful. Alright, now that that is over, there is one more thing we can do in Pewter City before we can actually leave. Yes, it is now night time. Ha ha ha. Okay, whatever. Um, what you're gonna want to do next is come over and see this old man here. Oh, he came all the way out here from Jodo. 
That brings back memories. When I was a, when I was young, I went to train Jota to train. Uh, yeah, okay, because this guy in the original games didn't even talk about Jota. Ha ha ha. So they didn't even exist back then. Anyway, um, we get the Silver Wings. So what we're gonna do now is head back to Johto. Okay, so after doing our, all of our missions that we've done before to get the uh, rail pass, which we've done in episode 1 and 2 of Kanto, just in case you missed that, head back to Saffron City, which is where you can access... Well, actually, where you can now access the train between Saffron and Johto, so yay. We'll be bounce up and down. <laughs> Okay, we have arrived in Goldenrod City. Alright. I just said that! Stop stealing my lines from me. Okay, now we're gonna to want to get a Pokemon that knows Fly. That's gonna be fun. Back to my PC we go! Okay, so I went to Goldenrod Department Store to see if I can actually pick up any repels there, and I only managed to pick up regular repels, which is kind of annoying. But anyway, you're going to want to fly to Seawood City. Yes, we've already been there. I didn't say we were never going to come back like I did the Olivine. Ha ha ha! Never going back there again. Um, let's have a look, see. I need a Pokemon that can learn Flash. And I know who it's Slave can learn Flash. Hooray! Alright, now. Remember those islands that we passed on our way to Seawood City? Well, they actually have a significance. So, let's quickly head out there now. I've got one Max Repel, hooray. Okay, you're obviously going to want another Pokemon that I surf. Route 41. Now, I'm pretty sure I battled all the trainers out here now anyway, so yeah, screw them all. Okay. I'll show you exactly what island to go into to make your trip a lot easier, so... Way. This is so boring. Oh! Oh, what? I thought I battled you! What? So. What? Ah, screw him. Let's overkill all of his Pokemon for being a faggot. Trainer Kirk, screw. Okay. Alright, whoa, okay. Gyarados. Well, screw you, you're going down anyway. Kill him! Finish him! Dun dun dun! Aha, uh -huh, critical hit. Yay, Bruce grows to level 45. Oh, okay, you got two Gyarados? Fair enough. Alright, let's see what Don Fan can do. Love that. Let's just quickly kill this thing with a uh, strength, I guess. I could have probably used anything there except for Mud Slap and it would have killed it. Alright, screw you, Swimmer Kirk, whatever your name is. And he grows to level 42 on top of that. Ha ha ha, even more humiliation for this guy. Tony Abbott. Oh, for crying out loud, can I not do anything? ARE YOU SERIOUS?! STOP DOING THAT WITH MY MONEY! I WILL KILL YOU! Anyway... I actually went the wrong way to begin with. This is where you're gonna wanna go. I did not mean to do that. OH WHAT?! I FORGOT TO POKE ON THE NOSE WHIRLPOOL! Anyway, after going back to the Pokemon Center and getting my... Tentacle, also called Slave Mark 2. Which knows Whirlpool. Now, anyway. We can head back to these islands here. Now, before I go and catch Lugia, there are a few items that I want to get that are kind of important. Ah, uh, there is a pause trick you can actually do to try and make the area light up without using flash, but I'm not going to try and do it. I can't, cannot be bothered. Okay, where are my repels? Please tell me. Okay, I've got a super repel. Sweet. Um, now we need flash. Okay, now, um, there's, that is the way you go to get to Lugia, but there are a lot of items that I want to kind of get first before I finish this episode up, so, there's an item there, an Ultra Ball, that's going to be handy, but even though I intend to catching every single Pokemon, this game with a Pokeball, that doesn't matter. Uh, one more item over here, I think, 
Yes. Um, alright. So, next time... An escape route is going to be really, really handy. Next time, Pokemon Crystal. I will see you guys at the previous entrance, okay? I'll see you guys then.